everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Fable 2. We are uh, still here on uh, Bowerstone Road, I think this is called. Uh, we're trying to make our way up to that exclamation point up there on top of the hill, which I believe is the Temple of Shadows. Uh, last episode, we got the renown needed to uh, uh, continue on with the Abbot in the Temple of Light mission. Uh, but we're going to start some of these other side missions while we can. Oh, wait. This is a bandit camp, right? Oh, there's no bandits in here. All right, great. Uh, yeah, so anyway, last episode we got enough renown for that uh, by uh, marrying a nice lady uh, who I had a child with uh, within the first 10 minutes of meeting her. Everything's good. Everything's fine. Uh, the, ghost, the ghost was all right with it, actually, believe it or not. He was a nice guy. Uh, I do- okay. Oh, they're gonna run away because I killed the big guy. That's a good tip, I guess. Oh, did that guy just fall over? <laughs> yeah, the, uh, the ghost was actually okay with it, uh, because he had realized how much, uh, pain she had gone through, even though that she ditched him on their wedding day and he committed suicide over her. I don't know, man. Who knows? Chicks, man. Am I right? Alright, dog. Is there no treasure around here? This seems like the perfect place for some treasure. Ooh, what's in here? Can we take all this stuff? Uh, also, my w I got notification that my wife is Nunya too happy with me? Uh, just because I set her, uh, I set her allowance super low because I don't really have that much money, uh, believe it or not, at this point in the game. So perhaps starting a family, getting married, and uh, <laughs> having a child, probably not the best uh, strategy early game. But you know what? Sometimes love, sometimes kids, they just don't come at the most opportune times. Hey, Tornado! Attack, Tornado! Alright. That was a cheap shot, bud. Alright, uh, okay, so... Yes, let's go do this. Can I upgrade? Oh, sorry, it's a Vortex. How much experience do I have? Not a whole lot. What is what is the Brutal Styles that I can get here? Flourishes. No, I think we're all right. Let's just save up our, our points for now. Ooh, that's bright. Oh, man, son. What is wrong with you? Why you have to be bright? Alright, so this is the uh, Temple of Shadows. Excuse me, sir. Can I interest you in joining the Temple of Shadows? Uh, sure. <laughs> ah, not one to blabber inanely, I see. We have a fair few of your disposition among us. Yes, you'll feel right at home. We're the fastest growing cult in Albion, you know. The entry requirements are quite simple. The temple insists all potential members perform an abominable act of nefarious evil. <laughs> now, of course, back when I joined, it was just kicking the crutches from disabled beggars. But you, you'll have to eat five crunchy chicks. Oh, okay, I can do that. Do you have them or do I have to go buy them? I have tofu. How about that? There really is no finer place to socialize with like-minded evil chaps. Right. Ah, excellent. You have to swallow every last bit, you know. The feathers, the bones, the... the beak. Oh, excuse me, please. Okay. <laughs> do you... do I have to go find them? Oh, no, he gives it. Okay. Uh, oh, man, I'm sorry, Crunchy Chick. Oh, I can't 
can't believe you did that. It, it was still alive. <laughs> Am I not supposed to do this? That, that is the vilest thing I've ever seen. And this, coming from someone who never misses Torture Tuesdays. Mm. Anyway, yes, welcome to the temple. You've earned your place among the shadows. All right, uh, great. I guess that wasn't too hard. Hopefully this place has, I get some like good weapons from this place. I'm gonna take a look around here. That logo is very reminiscent of like Gears of War with the spine. I see it, buddy. Yeah, that reminds me a lot of, a lot of the Gears of War logo, except without a gear. And with a spine. Ooh, an emerald. Great. I'm gonna have to sell that off to afford my freaking wife. <sighs> I wonder if I can just... Can I get an annulment? It hasn't really been that long. I think an annulment is appropriate. Welcome, young disciple, to the Temple of Shadows. I am Cornelius Grimm. You have entered a venerable society of dark worship, with a long history of wicked deeds and opprobrious transgressions. Friday's is poker night. <laughs> now, proceed down the hallway to our unholy wheel of misfortune. The most gruesome and terrifying device ever conceived. Okay. The instructions are right next to it. <laughs> okay. Man, I just came from Poker Night, my guy. Sacrificing to the shadows. I don't know if I really want to... I don't want to be a bad guy, you know? Hang on. The shadows just can't get enough sacrifices. Jolly well help them, they do. Each victim you bring in... Ooh, okay, that's fancy. I'll take that. I'm not gonna wear it, but I'll take the it. The sacrificial circle earns you a nice little bundle of loyalty points. And with the Temple of Shadows reward scheme, once you've earned enough points, you can collect <laughs> a really quite smashing prize. Uh, all right. <laughs> Fair enough. Let's uh, let's take a look at this place. See if there's anything else going on. I don't know if I really want to like. I don't really want to sacrifice anybody. Oh, there we go, silver key. I'm glad I came down this way. Actually, getting a lot of those right off the bat. It's a weird place, man. Yeah, I kind of feel bad. Third rooms this week. Nothing gets sacrificial stains out. Okay. <laughs> Great. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna be a good boy, I think. Not really into the whole sacrificial kind of deal. Although, we may take a look at that later, depending. I gotta figure out... Uh, like what the what the prizes are so we might sacrifice maybe my wife and child is that too dark they're, they're just costing me money at this point you're a gypsy you live in a gypsy camp wife how are you not happy with uh how are you not happy with what like five gold coins a day all right uh can we teach that to you Yes, we can. Great. You are a level two treasure hunter now. I guess that's good. Can't be bad. All right, and one last corridor here to explore. Lots of, lots of torture going on down here, apparently. Oh, I can't go down that way. Now this one might, I have no idea. I have no idea what that's for. All right, uh, anyway, it looks like that's about it. 
Um, let's go do... Yeah, I don't know if I want to sacrifice anybody. Alright, the, uh, the archaeologist. Let's go speak to him. You haven't found this location yet. You need to explore the world more. Where would this guy be, I wonder? Alright, dog, you run a little weird, if I'm honest. Alright, see you, freaks. I'll be back on Friday for poker night. You weirdos. I can't use the stairs. <laughs> there we go. Uh, hopefully this archaeologist fella is not too far. I think... I feel like I he's up at, like, the actual, like, castle. I'm fairly certain that that's a thing. So let's just teleport there and see if we can uh, get lucky with that. So, Bowerstone Market. Let's just go to the town square. I think, yeah, I think he's like up at the castle courtyard. Or he or she. I don't know yet. Archaeologist is a non uh, sex related whatever. Which of Bob? Sex specific. Looking splendid. Thank you. Come on, bud. Let's dig. It's ever so nice to see you. Yeah. Don't mind me. Just digging in your garden. Yellow belly dye. Yeah. So uh, another aspect. All right. You can see at the top. But uh, another aspect about this game is all the clothing items. <laughs> You can actually dye them uh, to whatever color you want. Uh, I usually go with like a greenish deal, but we'll see. If I remember correctly, I did not make my character look very good uh, the first go round in this one. Sleepy Bean Java Potion. Thanks, bud. Anything else while we run through the streets here? Yep. <laughs> Got it. Oh, uh, I can't open this, buddy. Oh, I can open it. It's only five. For some reason, they look like 15s until I get up close and personal with them. Potion of Life. Uh, what is this? Uh, the same sect of Old Kingdom alchemists who are said to have solved the secret of immortality also created a recipe for this life-prolonging potion. If you have knowledge or skill to brew it successfully now. Um, I think if I use this, it, like, permanently upgrades my life. Kind of like the Elixirs of Life uh, in the original Fable. Man, there's a lot of treasure here. What are you guys doing out here? Get yourselves a dog. Go find some treasure. Food ring. Great. Anything else, buddy? Good. Yes, so he's in the, uh, the Fairfax... Gardens. I knew it. See, I do remember things about this game. Not many, but some. Oh, we're in, like, high society right now. Ooh, dig site. Cool. You! Oh, it is Are a sheep. Are you she. willing to risk life, limb, and more as you quest for the remnants of lost civilizations? Oh. I suppose you want to know who I am. People are so conventional in this particular era. My name is Belle, and I'm Albion's foremost archaeologist, okay? Now, will you okay. embark on marvelous adventures in search of ancient artifacts or not? Yeah! I'm so glad that you're not going to bore me with a long speech. Will you travel the world to uncover ancient mysteries? Oh, never mind. I take that back. I spoke too soon. Here yes. is what I have on the item so far. Don't let archaeology down. Okay. Uh, what do we need? My research proves uh, conclusively that the first artifact is hidden somewhere in the oldest part of the city. Okay. So that's like Old Town. Look how small this guy is. Maybe not. He's standing in a ditch. But from this angle, he looks very tiny. 
Sorry, buddy. All right. Hey, also, archaeologist, how did you get permission to dig up the uh, Fairfax Gardens, uh, whatever? Oh, that's a pistol trader. Hey, will you he talk to me? To the right place. Wait, 2% discount because she loves me. 1% discount because she fears me. 32% markup? By God. Rusty turret pistol. Eh. I'm alright. I did say I was going to save my money. Which I am going to do. Let's see if we can go find this, mm. uh, this, uh, yes. thingy. Two miles away? It takes one hour to walk two miles? Yikes, I'm woefully... I am woefully out of shape. Alright, so we need to do Bowerstone Old Town. Why are you running? How may I help you today? Also, I might have to do some jobs in between episodes here just to get enough coin to buy a business so I can afford my wife. Another hour for two miles. Yikes. What are the people at Lionhead? What is Peter Molyneux at Lionhead doing? It takes him two hours to walk, or an hour to walk two miles? Come on now. Okay, so my dog knows. As soon as I get into the area, my dog knows. This is great. So I don't have to spend time trying to figure this out. I got you, buddy. Just in this alleyway? How convenient. Yeah! Yeah! Ancient scroll. The old, uh, this old parchment is somewhat worn by the passage of time. There's a strange symbol drawn in the centre. Okay, I don't think they're all going to be that easy. But that one is, at least. What's up, dog? Dog? Oh. <laughs> good, good boy. Great guy. Good dog. Good doggo. Economy value necklace. Not so good, doggo. <laughs> you tried, though. I appreciate it, buddy. Quite uh, striking. Thank you. I wonder how much our first business is going to cost. We might be able to buy one of those stalls on the bridge. And then hopefully we get a lot of money from it, because I'm, I'm going to go broke otherwise with this wife and kid. That's why you always wear protection, kids. Whew. All right, uh, before we go deliver that, I just kind of want to see if I can afford one of these. A pie stand? Pie trader. Yeah, I always extra. wanted to own a pie shop. Oh, man. Yeah, I can't afford that. How much do I get a day? Does it tell me? It actually has an address. 7C Market Square. Sometimes nothing <laughs> history. Sometimes nothing will quite satisfy like a pie. Okay. <laughs> Greater the the wealth of a shop. Yeah, no. Owners killed. Hero opinion. Sale price. Okay. How? Where's where's where? Okay, let's buy it. Why not? I want to be a pie salesman or a pie a pie guy. Okay. Profit. So, I mean, I could sell it right now and make 23 coins somehow. And that's with selling fees. Wait, that's not true. Maybe it is true. I don't know. All right, let's just keep it going. Keep it going. Keep selling them pies, buddy. <laughs> oh, I just got 23 coins income. Here we go. Now we're talking. Now we are talking. I wonder how often I get an income. Probably very often, considering it takes me two hours to walk one mile. Or, other way around. One hour to walk two miles. Hey, I got your parchment. Yes. Yes, thank you. 
You're welcome. Uh, yep. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, cool. So I don't think she gives us another quest right away. Um, I think, like... We have to leave. There's more daring exploits in the field of retrieving oh. ancient objects buried in the ground. That is, if you're up for it. What was wrong? Okay. This is what my latest research indicates would be a good target. Uh-huh. Right. Right. Uh, all the ancient texts point to an artifact hidden near the ruins of an old kingdom structure... One of them mentions a dark cathedral overlooking an ocean. Okay. I know where that is. That's, uh, we just came from there. The, uh, the shadow people. Greetings. The shadow people. Alright, uh, that. well this is like a, this is actually like a really long quest. Uh, and as you collect the artifacts and stuff, this hole actually gets deeper. And then I think it uncovers a demon door at some point. Not 100% sure on that. Uh, but if I am 100% sure, <laughs> if I am sure, or if I'm M correct, uh... Well, that was just a spoiler then. Uh, so yeah, we might go find this artifact next episode or whatever it is. But we're gonna go get on with the uh, we're gonna get on with the uh, the main story line next episode. Uh, but anyway, guys, that is where I'm gonna leave things off. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed this episode, please definitely leave a like and a comment below. And while you're at it, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you're not subscribed already. I do put out daily gaming videos, so be sure to do that so you don't miss anything. And I'll see you guys on the next episode.